My name is Elder Cortez Williams. I am the webmaster and one of two Facebook administrators for the Church of Living God's National Public Relations team. I am also one of several senior pastors here throughout the state of Florida and one of many elders within the Church of the Living God, Jill Dominion. And I am so excited to be introducing and welcoming you to our very first virtual 40 day fast devotional. Now for some of you who are saying, what is a virtual 40 day fast devotional? Don't worry, I'm gonna explain it to you. Over the next 40 days, starting January 1st, at noon every day, you will have a fresh face that will be giving you encouragement, inspiration, a call to action, and prayer. And all of the topics are based out of the Church of the Living God's 40 day fast prayer journal. Now, for those of you who are saying, well, who's gonna do it? We've got that covered as well. You will see faces from our chief overseer to our chief helpers, to some of our bishops, elders, prayer warriors, ministers, even our deacons stretched out across this great nation. Now, for those that are new to the faith or maybe beginning this 40 day fasting with us for the first time and you're new to this fellowship, you may be wondering why 40 days? I'm glad you asked that. It's an easy one to explain. 40 days is significant in the word of God several times. We go to Moses in the book of Exodus when he crosses over from Egypt into the wilderness and they cross the Red Sea. Before Moses gives any instruction or any direction, he goes onto the mountaintop for 40 days to pray, to fast, and to talk to the Lord. And in that praying and fasting, he comes back down with the commandments from God. Yes, the very same commandments that we grew up learning as, as rule and rhyme in our lives and in our hearts. Moses took 40 days of fasting and prayer to receive this. We go to our very own Lord and Savior Jesus Christ, whom after being baptized in the book of Matthew by John the Baptist, comes straightway out of the water, the Lord speaks from heaven, the spirit descends on the shoulders of doves, and he gets up and moves into the wilderness to fast for 40 days for preparation of ministry. After explaining this, it makes it very simple. We enter every year in the Church of the Living God, Jordan, with 40 days of fasting and praying to hear from God and receive direction and clarity on our year, to ensure that we are within God's will and that no matter what comes to us through this year, our spirits, our hearts, and minds are prepared for it. Now, someone that is new to the faith might be saying, what is the significance of fasting? And what is fasting? That's another easy one to explain. Fasting is simply refraining from something that is important or vital to you to receive something in exchange. For us in the Church of the Living God, from 12 a.m. to 12 p.m., we fast. We make sure that we turn away our plates and our cups and we don't eat or drink for those 12 hours. We pray and we pray on specific topics so that God will hear our petition and guide us through this year. It is an exchange to show God that His will is more important than our will. And ultimately, His will is what's best for us. Now, I want you to understand something. It is important to follow the instructions to the team. But if you have medical conditions, if your doctor has instructed you to take certain medications and those medications require you to eat, please do so. Understand that God is a God that is a healer and he performs miracles every day. And we in the Church of Living God do not doubt that. But Jesus himself was even wise enough to carry Luke, a physician, with him. We want you to be healthy and we want you to be wise throughout this fast while receiving from God. It is important if you are new to fasting to take your time. Drink water to prepare yourself in this fast. In between the fasting times when you do eat, don't eat large portions. Take it slow. And sometimes even add a little lemon to your water. As you go through fasting and you refrain your body from food, bodily fluids increase within your stomach and lemon in your water can help subside that. This will not be easy for some, but I encourage you to stick through it. If you come through on the other side, you will see that there is a reward and there is victory to be had in this 40 day fast. I am over ecstatic to go through this journey with you. My heart, my mind, and my spirit man is ready and prepared for this year's 40 day fast. On behalf of the Church of the Living God as a whole, our chief overseer, Dr. Bishop Faye Moore, 
our chief helpers, and the national public relations team, we say thank you for beginning to go on this journey with us. I pray your strength, I pray your growth, and I pray that you be delivered and receive whatever you're seeking God for in these 40 days. Please remember that this is the year that we are to be faithful unto death, expecting a crown of life from the Lord, and as always, to God be the glory. Again, my name is Elder Cortez Williams, and I wish you well throughout these next 40 days. God bless you.